Hi, this is Courtney Mahan at the Tour Striker Golf Academy in Phoenix, Arizona. And I'm bringing to you another pregnancy tip for my pregnancy series. Obviously, I'm down on the bunker and I want to discuss with you how to get the ball high and soft. That way, when we do have to contend with these high lips, we're not afraid. So, as my pregnancy goes on, obviously my belly's got pretty big. And what I need to do is I'm going to use that to my advantage because in the bunker, the number one thing to get over these high, high lips would be to make sure that we have enough loft on our club face. So there's plenty of loft here, but I'm actually going to add some loft. That's right. So I'm going to make my hands actually behind the club head. But in order to do that, I can't be too close to this golf ball. So the closer I stand to the ball, the harder it would be for me to have loft on the club face. So I need to make sure that I back up and give myself enough room, almost feel like you're way too far away from the ball to make sure that I can utilize the entire golf club and to have the most loft possible. So you can see as I get further away from the ball, this club can lay flatter and flatter and the handle gets closer and closer to the ground. So obviously with my belly, that's an advantage because now it's really not in the way. Okay, so I'll go ahead and hit another one. You can see that I'm fairly far away from the golf ball. I've got my handle back a little bit to utilize the loft of the golf club. The club face is aiming at the target. And then from there, I'm just gonna try to land right behind the golf ball. For more success out of the bunkers, especially over those high lips, make sure that you're further away from the ball so we can utilize the loft of the golf club. For more tips, check out my YouTube page at Courtney Mahan Golf. Thanks for watching.